So Izan, you are the actual training manager for the whole Tips and Toes. They have their own training center. So I'm speaking to an expert right now. And um, I know that um, I've heard of cupping. What do you call it here? I love it. It's the cup thing. kiss. I love that, cup kiss. It's a great name because it actually kisses the skin. With us, you have the silicone cupping. It's a massage that we do with an oil. So what happens is we squeeze the cup, we suction the skin, and you move it along. It's detoxifying, helps with lymph drainage, and water retention and cellulite. This also creates a deep tissue massage, so it's very relaxing. And then you move it along with the oil. If you do not have oil on the body, your cup will not move. And the bigger cups is for the body and the buttocks area. And the smaller the cup, the smaller the area. So you can do the throat area and the face. You can do drainage if you have sinus issues, anti-aging, water retention, any on the skin. So give me an example of when a client's come here to Tips and Toes and they've used it for something to heal or to help with. So once it would be help for aches and pains on joints, it will help for water retention, it will help if they've actually had a really bad time with um, partying, being out, they want to detox, maybe they're going on a healthy spree with eating, so you want to detox, and it helps with the cellulite. Immediately after the session, you'll have that feeling of well-being and relaxation. The only thing is that you should take your green tea or your water to flush. Otherwise, you will end up with a headache or you'll feel um, discomfort. You'll feel uncomfortable because the toxins are moving through. Um, but what you could do or what I would suggest, if you're doing it for any healing purposes or you're doing it for your cellulite, I would suggest you have it twice a week for at least one month, because then you'll start seeing the results. And then the next month you do it once a week, the following month you do it every second week, and then eventually you do a maintenance of once a month.